this coming Thursday, that's Christmas Eve, the 24th of December, the federal government will finally, two years later, be releasing its long-awaited EV policy slash strategy paper detailing how they envision Australia to progress to like cleaner and greener forms of transport. And well, sadly, the cat is already out of the bag and well, it's a non-starter. Here are the exciting takeaway points from it. $72 million in funding already announced for co-investing in charging infrastructure. Who here has seen the ABC comedy Utopia, AKA Dreamland? That's like the overseas version of the same show. Rob Sitch, like he's responsible for rebranding and renouncing government announcements and to make them seem like the newly fund funded projects. Yep, Scotty from marketing is very good at this. Uh, nation building authority, COVID gas led recovery, it's all BS. And well, Utopia is the media partner. Anyhow, a two year trial on electric car fleet for Comcar, which provides cars and drivers for like politicians and well, high, poli um, you know, judgy people. And you know, and well, mm hmm. What? Another trial? Nine years after this? I wonder what changed. Yeah, like tech, batteries, Tesla, and more. There's no need for a trial. Just do like New Zealand has done and get on with it. Another exciting feature of the EV's policy paper is updating the green vehicle website. Uh, done. And finally, they'll be asking energy agencies to look at options for car to home and car to grid battery use. <sighs> done and done. Seriously. Oh my God, Angus, buddy, if you're watching, what are you doing? This is pathetic. Did you like forget to do your homework? So you just like scrape together a few little papers, just wrote a few little bits on paper, asked a friend on the phone before the meeting and said, what the hell am I supposed to do? I've got to bring something. I promised it two years ago and I have done nothing. It is absolutely I could just imagine you. Yeah, yeah, look, this will do. People hate EVs, right? Yeah, they're gonna ruin the weekend. No, we do care. Where are the ICE car bans, vehicle emission standards, petrol standards, EV incentives? There's like zip nada nothing here. It's pathetic. And well, something I won't be reporting on post Christmas. So with that disappointing yet predictable news out the way, I just wanna remind viewers that we all need to be active in this space and we'll reach out to our local member and talk to them. Obviously, do it politely <laughs> and, you know, sincerely and educate them, help them understand what it actually means and what it looks like to be driving around in an electric vehicle. Or if, if, if EVs, EVs aren't your thing, you don't drive, that's fine. Get them to support policies around solar, wind, battery storage, um, you know, circular economies, um, so, and using less. Yeah, Partic participate in local communities, join, um, a local action group. Just shift the conversation towards cleaner and greener ways of transport and well, living for that matter. Look, I've left links below to the two petitions that are going on now for uh, EV incentives. So please do put your name down below and let's make this world a better place. Mm -hmm.